What's up, everyone? This is Comwalk, and welcome to another bi monthly visit from Barrow. This is the 78th rotation on December 1st, 2017, on PC. So let's see, we're here on Loretta Relay. So, first of all, we have something new. We have the Kavat Sentinel Mask for 500 ducats and 200k credits. Uh, here's the thing I, I do like using Sentinels, but I don't really like those accessories too much but this is actually pretty cool looking because uh it's a it's a kavat sentinel mask and i can definitely see the the silhouette and like whole uh, design outline uh, of the mask it looks pretty cool i might get it maybe uh but currently i'm kind of uh back into using uh kubros at the moment but yeah, uh, we have... Okay, these are the impact mods. These are the Operation Profit mods. Uh, they were once an event mod, uh, but now they're back. Uh, definitely got these if you do use impact weapons. Often effective against the corpus. But yeah, we have Pummel, Crash Course, uh, Full Contact, and Collision Force. All 120% impact. Uh, definitely don't use the your ducats, because you could definitely just get these from uh, fighting... The, uh, the Eidolon, taking down the Eidolon. So, uh, if you really need it, sure, get it, but you can definitely just get these while playing through the game. Uh, we have the Machete Wrath returning. Wraith, or uh, Wrath, however you guys want to say it. Uh, I'd say this is a good weapon now, because this was once often, or actually this weapon type was often was regarded as not very good, just because of how stiff it's, I think, default stance, or... Uh, the Sundering Weave stance uh, that was it was meant for it wasn't very uh, very good, but ever since it's gotten tweaked, I'd say to be honest, I like using machetes now, especially with the uh, Cyclone uh, Crockin mod, amazing amazing mod, good damage multipliers too. But uh, yeah, I recommend the Machete ra uh, Wraith in its current status status. Uh, the returning EOS Prime armor set, uh, if you don't have it, get it, it's really cool, it's very primey, <laughs> uh, yeah, just the same thing if you need them separately, but might as well get it in a, in a bundle if you haven't gotten it already. Uh, we have the Nexus fur pattern for the Kubro, I'm actually gonna try to get this, cause, uh, I like Kubros, I just haven't given them enough love. <laughs> uh, we have the Katir Sentinel Wings, once again with the whole diamond and angler aesthetic, uh, if you like Sentinels. Uh, the Baroque Katir Glyph, or you can, or as, or as I like to call it, the Baroque Katir uh, Selfie. <laughs> uh, we have the Corrupted Bombard Spectre uh, Blueprint, uh, definitely the toughest of the Spectres. I would say, but I don't really use Spectres too often, but if you're into that, try it out. Uh, now this, I, I do like to talk about for a quick second, because this only shows up. This is a very seasonal Katir item. Uh, it will it did show up at uh, at the Tenocon uh, Bro Katir Relay, but this Katir, of all the side downs that he brings, this is my favorite, just because uh, it's very uh, PBR treated. It's shinier than the normal uh katir sign donna so pbr looks really nice on this especially with their prime fames so it'll look extra shiny and i like the the internal like deco that has it's very cool it's very pretty so yes i say yes to this <laughs> and the sense of Minora blueprint but uh yeah this is the uh 78th uh, rotation hall uh, this is pretty much it. It's nothing too crazy. I won't say anything too good. It's it's like typical kind of stuff, uh, except for the Katir Solstice Sign Dino, which is really nice. So I I'd say the highlight of this is get this. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, you guys have a good one.